guys, moms. Oh my gosh, happy Mother's Day. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for being with these little kiddos, these little tiny people and loving them and loving them. Thank you so yes. much. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Have you guys told your mom happy Mother's Day yet? You know what, pause and go make your mom some princess toast right now. Ooh. Tons of sugar, tons of sparkles, 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 love and maybe that. a little bit of glitter. Now. Go hug your mom, tell her you love her, and that she's amazing too. Yes. Go do it. We're watching. Okay, okay, now you're good. Sweet, sweet. Oh my gosh, so what, what, what are we doing here? What, what, what are we doing? Um, well, we're here on Mother's Day, so we can do the preschool message. That's right. Are you excited? Oh, the preschool message. I'm so excited for the preschool message. I love the preschool kids. They're so, they're so cute. They're so cute. <laughs> they're my favorite. All right, so what do we do first? I think we have to start off with our memory verse. Memory verse. Okay. What do if you, you don't know, know the memory? I know it. Do you know it? I know it. I know it. But maybe we should do it one time to show them in case they don't know it. Okay. Makes sense. Yeah. Makes sense. All right. So nothing mm -hmm. can separate us from God's love. Romans 8, 39. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all. You got it? Now okay. say it with us, all right? One more time. Say it loud and proud. <laughs> nothing, nothing can, can separate, separate us, us from, from God's, God's love. love. Romans 8, 39. I think we should do it one more time. Not everybody was doing it. I need y'all to stand up. You guys have to yeah, do it with us. Yeah, I see us. you. Stand up. Come on. Y'all get on. ready. Okay. Let's do it. Nothing, Nothing can, can separate, separate us, us from, from God's love. love. Romans 8, 39. That was so great, you guys. You did awesome. Sweet. I think it's time for the next thing. And this next is my thing. favorite part. The next thing? What's the next thing? <sighs> guys, it's time for praise and worship. I'm Ooh. super excited for praise and worship. Are you guys ready? Yeah, I'm trying to do the floss thingy. I don't Is that know what how you're going to do, do for praise and worship? Yeah. Okay, that works. <laughs> All right, we count down, right? right? We have to count Wait. down. What if I don't know how to count? We'll help them. Well, what, I don't know how to count. Can you help me? Well, then I can, I can try to help you. I, oh. <laughs> All right, I'll see let's what I go. Can do. Let's count down from 10. From 10? I thought we started at 8. It goes eight. Ten is five, a better number. It's, eight, it's a three. much better number. Okay. Let's do ten. All right, ten. Let's go ten. Ten. All right. Ten. ten nine. Eight. eight seven, seven. Six. six five, five. Four. Three. Two. One. one. All right. Now look at me. You looking at me? Look right in my eyes, right here. I need you to look closely. Come on, look closely. I need you to focus. Come on, focus in. Focus in. Deep breath and out and focus. That's what we're going to do together on this next one. We want to focus and look closely to Jesus as we worship him together. That's what this is all about. And as we focus on him, we learn what it means to love him and to look like him and to act like him and to love like he does. That's what focusing will help us to do. So you can hashtag focus right now in the comments if you want to focus on Jesus every single day. Hashtag focus. Go ahead. Do it. Hashtag focus. <laughs> because we're going to keep looking to him in everything that we do. You ready to learn this song with us? So it goes like this. For even when it's hard for me to see, to see, I will trust in him, I will believe, believe. Even when it's hard for me to see, to see, I will trust in him, I will believe. And keep on looking, looking, looking to you. Go and we go there too. I'll keep on looking, looking, looking to you. I'll fix my eyes on you you are my only focus you are my only focus you are my only focus I'll fix my eyes on you you are my only focus you are my only focus you are my only focus you are my This is hey. my faith. 
is true. Oh my god. Okay. It it's it's so cool. It's like one of the best facts I'm about so the Bible for is that story. it's super duper true, okay? Yeah. So, this story is about an awesome queen oh. named Esther. Sounds pretty. She's beautiful. She sounds pretty. And can y'all Did she have a crown? She did. She had a beautiful crown. Can you guys put your crowns on? Yes. Act like you're putting a crown on your head. Okay, so Esther was the queen. Okay, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, okay. Mm-hmm. So say Esther. 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 Who is the queen? Elizabeth. No, no, not Elizabeth. It was Esther. 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 Esther queen Esther. Okay. Loved God. Oh, that's and good. she knew that God had a plan for her. Okay. She was a great queen, super duper awesome queen Ooh, okay. that loved God. She sounds awesome. She does sound pretty so awesome. cool. She sounds awesome. But there awesome. was also a really bad man named Haman. Haman? What kind of name is Haman? Haman was a bad man. Mm. Very bad man. Okay. Mm. So Haman did not love God, mm. but he had a plan of his own. What? And his plan was to do something very bad to Esther's friends <gasps> and family. No. 
Oh, what no. happened? What happened? Oh, no. Esther, when she found out, she was so sad because she loved her friends and family. Yeah. Mm-hmm. She mm-hmm. loved her friends and family. And then guess what? what? Haman worked for the king. What? No. Yes. He worked for the so king. Esther knew that Haman had this really bad plan, mm-hmm. but he also worked for the king. So Esther couldn't just go and tell on Haman because he worked for the king. Oh my god! She didn't want the king to get mad at her because the king didn't know that Haman's plan was for Esther's friends and family. So what'd she do? What happened? She was just really scared. But guess what? What? She had a cousin named Mordecai. Mordecai? Mordecai. Yes. That's a cool name. I love that name. Mordecai. Mordecai. It's so fun to say. Yeah, it is. So Mordecai told Esther... Uh Better yet, he reminded Esther mm. that God loved her Aww. and that he had a plan for her. Okay. I and like Esther it. was like, oh, yeah, I'm a child of God, right? Right. So then Esther went and she told the king. Okay. And guess what the king did? What did he do? He saved her friends he and saved- family. <gasps> The king listened to her. He listened to the her. The king listened to and her. And he was so thankful that she told him because he didn't want to hurt her friends and family because of guess not. what? What? They loved God too. What? Yes. It's just so amazing that Esther knew that God loved her so much that he would take care of her. And it's so amazing that Esther had a cousin who reminded her that God loved her so mm. much. Yeah. And he had a plan for her. And in the end, it all worked out for Esther. Wow. Mordecai. I like Mordecai. Yeah, that's yeah, so absolutely. great. Absolutely. And the bottom line, y'all, y'all get it? The bottom line from the story? Um, I think I remember it. Listen to Mordecai? Listen to Mordecai. Ah, that's a good point that the story made, but the bottom line, Candlin, might you know? I think it's that God loves you? Yes. Uh, yes, that's uh, it. God loves you. Yes, God loves you, and he loves Esther, and he loves everybody, and he's oh. got a plan for you. Each and every one of you, God has a plan for you. And if you ever forget, you find your cousin, you find your friend, mm-hmm. and you re- let them remind you, okay? Let them remind you that God has a plan for you. That's an amazing bottom line. Yes, That's and I love that story. Awesome story. I love that story. Esther's awesome. She really is. So I think we should go ahead and pray out. Yeah. Go Are you guys it. ready to pray with us? How do Are we you? pray? You guys ready? So can y'all show, show them how we pray? Candlin? Yeah. So how about we put one arm up and then the other arm up. Then we're going to clap it together and wiggle it down. All right. God, thank you so much for your plans. Thank you for your plans for Esther. And thank you for the plans that you have for us. We know that your plans are always the greatest plans because you love us so much. And we love you too. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Amen. That was awesome prayer. That was. <sighs> that story was amazing. Check it out. Did Check you it like out. it? Check it. I mean, what is not to like? It was so great. Did you guys love that story? You liked it? Moms, did you like it? Moms, moms, did you like it? Did you like it? Did you like it? Did you like it? Who's going to tell their moms about the story? You have to tell your mom. When mm-hmm, you're eating mm-hmm, your Mother's mm-hmm, Day mm-hmm, meal today, mm-hmm, tell mm-hmm, your mom mm-hmm, mm-hmm. all about the story that we learned today, guys. Oh, my goodness. Like, I've been, moms, like, I want to give, can we give, can we give them these flowers, Candace? Ooh. Can, yes. They're not real. But we can just you should go buy some for your mom at the store. For your mommy for Mother's Day. We are so excited that you guys came and you worshiped and you listened to story with us. It was so much fun having you guys here. But I think it's, it's time for us to go, unfortunately. Time to go. Time to go. I so, know. but would we do something very, 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 oh my gosh, so very special? What? We get to pray. We get to pray. We're going to pray out. Okay. We're going to pray to God and basically it's like talking to Him because He's our dad. And we are going to lead off, Candlin. Okay. Lead off. Okay. All right. So we're going to go clap to the left. Okay. Then clap to the right. Okay. And then, like, you're doing, like, like you're swimming. You're going to go. Ooh. Swim it down. Okay. All I right. can do that. All right. Left. Go. Right. Swimmy. Woo. All right. God, thank you so much for everything that you've done for us. Thank you for our moms. Today on Mother's Day, we pray that we can tell this message to someone else and they can know how much you love us. Thank you so much. In Jesus' name we pray, amen.
Woo-hoo. All right, bye, mommies. Oh, my forgot to tell my mom. Bye, mom. I love you. Wait, there's there's one more thing. Make sure you remind everyone to subscribe to our YouTube channel and tell the parents to join our parent group on Facebook. We definitely want to stay connected to you guys right now. So I think that's it. Bye, guys. See you next time. Woo.